But yes, so I had a bit of drama the other day. Bit of drama. I was sitting there, minding my own business, and, um, you know, I'm just hanging out, having a good time. It's probably like 1 p.m., so, you know, morning for me. And, um, and all of a sudden, I start sneezing. And at first, it's just one or two sneezes, and I get, like, normal seasonal allergies, so I was like, ah, whatever. But then the sneezing doesn't stop for, like, 20 minutes straight. And I'm starting to feel crazy. Like, I just can't stop sneezing. I, I am walking around the house just like, what is wrong with me? Why can't I stop? And like, I take allergy medicine and that does nothing. And I can't stop sneezing and I'm, I'm freaking out. And I go and I look into the mirror and my eye, uh, right here, this eye, you can't really tell because I got like a little bit of stuff on it. Uh, it's still kind of swollen. Um, my eye started swelling up. Uh, I like, <laughs> at first, when I first looked, it was just like a little bit. And then as I kept sneezing and feeling rough, it started getting like really, really big. And I was like, oh shit. Like it looked like I had gotten punched in the face. It looked really bad. Uh, let me see. I might even have a picture. It was really crazy. Yeah, I think I do have a picture here somewhere. I look really rough in this picture. Well, it's just a picture of my eye, but you'll get the gist of it. Yeah, you can kind of... Oh, yeah, there it is. <laughs> yeah, that was like in the big... Oh, oh, there it is. That was how it started to look in the beginning. And it started to like look like that. And then it started to get worse and worse and worse. And so... I know. Oh, no, I know. And so then I'm like, okay, clearly there is something on me. I, I don't know if, like, if I touch something that I'm allergic to. It does look like you got punched. I know. So I was like, I don't know if I touch something I'm just allergic to or what. So I'm going to go get in the shower and try to, like, get off whatever is on me. So I shower. And I'm not in the shower five minutes when all of a sudden my feet start itching like crazy. Where I was like, like, I felt like a crazy person. I was like, oh, my God. Oh my God. So I, I get out of the shower. I get dressed really quick. And like, I, I sit on the bed and I'm like, what's wrong with me? What's wrong with me? And my feet start itching like crazy. I mean, they are itching so bad that I have to get like ice packs and put them on them. And then the itching spreads to my knees and then it spreads to my arms. And I'm like, oh no. And all of a sudden I start feeling a little dizzy. And I was like, Okay, so calmly, very calmly, I um I got up, I um I, I I got ready really quick, and I was like, I think it's time to go to the hospital. <laughs> yep. So <laughs> yeah. So um, very quickly at a very quick pace, uh, Penta drives us to the hospital. We are going very fast. We probably went 90 down the highway. Uh, and the whole time I'm just sitting there and I'm like, I have that feeling like I'm going to pass out. I do not feel good at all. And I'm just trying to focus. I'm trying to steady my breathing. I'm like, okay, everything's fine. I feel good. Everything's great. And I'm trying to like focus on anything that'll keep me from just like passing out and making the, this whole dramatic thing. And, um, but anyway, we arrive and safely I get in. And it, <laughs> so they put me, Hippie, thank you. So I'm in the ER and they put me like in the, like in the first room you go into in the ER. They put me in there and this, this lady is just like asking me questions and she's like, yeah, yeah. Okay. I see. And she's just kind of asking me questions and writing it all down. She's like taking my heart rate and my blood pressure. It's all sky high. And, um, you know, at first I didn't think it was, you know, too serious minus the dizziness. Until this guy comes in to the ER and he's like, excuse me, I'm having chest pains. Um, I'm not feeling great. I, I have chest pains. I'm, I'm freaking out. And the nurse looks at him and she's like, could you just take one of those blue cards and fill it out? I'll be with you in a moment. <laughs> and I was like, oh my God. And to the point where I was like, um, should I, like, you can take my place for a minute. I, I didn't say that, but I was like, please, like, please check out this guy that's dying of a heart attack in front of me. 
he ended up uh, being fine. But um, but anyway, so after they're just like, yeah, you're clearly having an allergy attack. This isn't good. Uh, then they asked me to sit in the waiting room. And after they tell me, like, this clearly isn't good, you know, we got to get this under control. They put me in the waiting room for two hours. <laughs> two hours! They put me in the waiting room. And um, two hours is the point where they finally get me some, like, uh, Benadryl. <laughs> two hours! <laughs> Yeah, so they came to me at first and were like, um, like after two hours, and they said, um, hey, so we're wanting to put, she kind of, the nurse like comes in, okay, or not the nurse, the doctor, uh, the ER doctor, she comes in, she looks at me, and um, she's like, yeah, so you had an allergy attack, and I'm, I'm trying to tell her what happened, and she's like, yeah, 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 and I'm like, okay. I just, look, I, like, all of a sudden, my eyes started swelling. She's like, yeah, 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 okay, okay, so let's see. Uh, yeah, so you've got this and this, and I'm like, I is it safe to go back in my home where this just happened all of a sudden? She's like, yeah, 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 you'll be fine, you'll be fine. So anyway, we're thinking, like, <laughs> and I'm like, okay, well, I'm just gonna let her do her thing. So you should have laid on the floor and pretended to pass out. I know, I was just like... Okay, this is fine. If she doesn't seem worried, maybe I shouldn't be worried. So she's like, yeah, we're, we're thinking about just giving you um, an IV and just putting all this stuff in you. Or we're thinking like um, it was going to be like a, a steroid. It was going to be Benadryl and a hydroxyzine, I think, or something. They were just going to throw all that in me. And I was like, look, <laughs> every time I get blood taken, I pass out. <laughs> I've never had an IV before and I don't want right now to be the time that I figure out I also pass out with IVs is there any way we could do just like oral medication she was like yeah yeah of course but it's gonna take longer and I was like fine fine and at this point the swelling in my eye has gone down not because of any medicine but because it's been two hours and I'm looking, I'm starting to look normal. So, yeah, we're there for another hour, maybe another, I'd say another 30 minutes to an hour, maybe 45 minutes. I'll say 45 minutes before they get the Benadryl and everything like that to me. And then they're like, yeah, now we have to write up the medication, so it's going to be another hour. <laughs> and, but so, like, all the time it took us to just, like, you know, get all our information and get out of there, it took a total of, like, three to four hours. Of sitting in the uh, sitting in the ER, so that was an experience. They were writing a book. You're telling me, and so I got out of there. It hasn't happened again. They gave me some um, like I said, I'm still on steroids and stuff like that. So I've been feeling a lot better. Actually, even my daily allergies have been better. And weirdly enough, I've been stronger. <laughs> <laughs>